I'll trade this money for some time. I'll take whatever I can find. It's like digging. Now, okay, so since I know kind of, I kind of already know how this whole thing is going to play out. Um, so I'm just going to actually throw, this is, it sounds muffled. So in or, the, the way to take care of something that sounds muffled, if, you didn't, if it didn't already sound bright enough going in, is EQ. And, and, and I know that this, this has to be EQ. So we're going to kind of flip back and forth between the EQ and the de uh, And that's how I kind of get my, uh, the final result. So uh, what I like to do is I like to overdo it and then back off. And, and I'll show you, I'll demonstrate this for a second. I'll trade this money for some time. I'll take what I... Oh, okay, so this is my favorite setting when I'm doing, using high end on vocals. This high mid frequency right here, this channel is the magic channel, and this is the magic button. Honestly, take that note down. Magic channel, magic button, right there. Uh, I don't really mess with this that much. That's just uh, the cue there, and but I do mess with this, the uh, what frequency it's affecting, and the uh, obviously the the gain of the frequency. So I'm just going to overdo it so it sounds really brittle and bright, so I can f really hone in on the presence of her voice. That's what you want to do. You want to find where her voice naturally has a presence, and that's what we're searching for right now. So you, can't, you don't want to just throw high end because different people have high end in different registers of their voice. So you want to actually, it's like you're tuning in to the presence of their voice and you're, you're, finding, you're finding that. I'll trade this money for some time. I'll take whatever I can find. It's like digging for gold. It's getting old. Okay, so I'm hearing, it might be hard for you guys to hear these subtleties, and this is why your mixing environment is actually really important too. Um, I'm finding it around, it's like uh, 3.4 kilohertz is kind of where I'm finding her presence.